up everybody, it's your boy here, Messy Miles, coming in with the tea on your favorite celebrities and entertainment news, bitch! I just got through watching Love and Hip Hop Hollywood, and I just had to get this damn camera and learn how to use it, bitch, because you know I got a new Canon camera, bitch. Step y'all pussies up if you're still using your MacBook, bitch. dust off this camera and get my ass on this YouTube and review this. I know I ain't reviewed the first two or three episodes. I'm not really sure what episode we on, but bitch, it went down too nice. I don't talk about everything. I just want to get down to the main course, bitch. I don't need no appetizer like little Fizz. I just need to get down to the main course, bitch. The steak and the potatoes. First thing that really just popped in my mind is this blogger that, that was introduced tonight. The one that friends with um Nikki and the one that's friends with Bitch, everybody. He was friends with everybody. He knew everybody. That's the one that got him to it with B. Scott this past summer, bitch. Where he put on Instagram, uh, B. Scott's, uh, eviction notice, bitch. And I was all up on Instagram like, Shut up, Papa! That's why I mind my business and I don't tell my business to everybody because you would never know when Miles getting evicted, which I won't be getting evicted because I get the rent and the mortgage and the light bills paid, okay? He was sitting down with, uh, Lil Fizz Appetizer. I don't really know her name. So we gonna call her, uh, Spinach Dip. He was sitting down with spinach dip and she was just talk, telling him that um, what had happened pretty much they threw and she was like pouring a tea to him about a uh, little fizz sex game and all kind of shit and his mess ass just sitting there soaking it all up like a big fat ass sponge bitch he was just he was loving it ba da ba 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 bitch he was loving it like McDonald's he took that information bitch ran into Lil Fizz talking to April Bitch, he just sat down like he was invited, like they told him, look, we on our way to McDonald's, to Wendy's, why don't you come on through, like y'all just friends, you don't do that, like, especially if I don't know you and I know of you, you don't just invite your damn self in, this nigga was having a full-fledged Barbara Walters interview with, with Little Fizz about his relationship, and Little Fizz, you really should have checked him right then and there and told him, listen, you're not finna tell me about what this bitch said. I'm not finna tell you on my... Like, who are you? Are you her lawyer? He definitely crossed the line because, you know, if that's your friend, I understand. But as a blogger, you have a job to do, bitch, and that's to get tea. Not just defend your goddamn friend and bring up his damn sex game with your messy ass. Messy ass motherfucker. Then, Nikki sat down with this nigga. I think his name is Jason. So, Nikki was sitting down with Jason ass. And she was telling him that she wanted to bring her girl Hazel E because she used to be a publicist. I ain't know that bitch. I ain't know. So he got up and talking about how she ain't no publicist. She was an intern and how she was lying. Here come Hazel E with her beak. They go in, bitch. Like, just cattiness. Like, how old are y'all? Nikki sitting her ass up there. Just like hand on hit head like she just so stressed out. Like, she just don't, she just can't believe. Bitch, you knew. I'm trying to figure out, bitch, who friend is you? Who friend is you? If I'm trying to, I don't give a damn who you are, okay? You, yeah, you want to invest in my business, yeah, I want your money, but if this my A1, since day one, you're not going to come at them no kind of way. I don't give a damn. You have to fight both of us. So, next thing you know, they going back and forth, and this nigga take a whole glass of alcohol beverage, and he threw it right in this bitch beak. That bitch eyes was burning like 900 degrees. The hot boy, she couldn't see nothing. She was just a wife nigga. I'm like, bitch, nick it. Let that bitch wipe her face on your fur. Get that bitch a napkin. Somebody please get this bitch a towel. Hey, hey, leave this bitch at your friend. She letting you sit there, your eyes burning. You can't see. You Ray Charles and motherfucker Steve wanted to the bullshit, bitch. For this blogger to do that, I, I really feel like that was really a pussy made. You, that was really bitch made. Like, bitches do that. Like, I understand you may be gay, but you ain't no bitch. You a grown-ass, big motherfucking man with a, with a no-hawk. With that greasy-ass no-hawk. You need your ass whooped. You would never throw no drink in no man face and think you finna skedaddle like that on me. Like you finna run out on a check like Mama D did. Allegedly. This bitch eyes burn talking about some when she <laughs> gained her sight back, she gonna fuck him up or get somebody to fuck him up. No, you ain't Hazel. Don't nobody know you. Don't nobody know you. I don't know the girl name. I don't know her name. The, the one who uh got the man who a big time producer that ain't nobody never heard of. The one with the Rubik's Cube teeth. The one with the teeth that go like, they shaped like uh Wi-Fi bars. They got him to it last week because she walked in the studio on some um Inspector Gadget shit and she caught him 
with no ring on his finger and he was hugged up with some bitch. So he came home the next day and she, this bitch was shaking like she had Tourette's bitch. Like she was really about to go off. Like I was shaking with her ass like, ooh bitch, what's finna happen? He was basically telling her, bitch, you know, I'm not finna commit to your ass and wear no damn ring and you a crazy ass bitch dressing up like you fucking a pizza man trying to catch me some shit I may or may not be doing. If you got to do all this, to try to catch your man cheating or catch anybody cheating or catch anybody doing something they ain't supposed to do, bitch. If you can't trust the man, trust their ass, bitch, pack up your shit and move the fuck on, bitch. Move on like my girl. It ain't that goddamn serious. So then he get his ass up and he walk up out the house. And he turn this bitch and he like, since you know what, since you, since you think about this ring so much, bitch, and you like this ring so much, bitch, with your light skin ass and your maxi dress, bitch, you can have this ring, bitch. And he threw the ring, bitch, and this bitch went bananas, grapes, pears, pineapples, and peaches, bitch. This bitch went all. Oh, she got the shuffling, like she really wanted to run. But I think her maxi dress, or whatever kind of dress that was, was a little too tight around her ankles. So she couldn't really move like she wanted to. So she wobbled her way to the street. And by this time, he had already gotten a humble bitch that was across the street. And she was like, you This nigga in the truck. He cranks up the truck. This bitch wobbles her way to the front of the truck. Like, I'm thinking to myself, girl, it's 2015, bitch. He don't have to go forward to get away from your ass. And basically, now you just look dumb in the middle of the street. And for what? Why you got to put yourself through all this bullshit for somebody who got Rubik's Cube teeth, bitch? Get your ass in the motherfucking house, bitch, and stop doing that stupid ass shit. It, listen, if the nigga don't want you, if you got to go through his trash, and you got to follow him and fight him, and cry yourself to sleep and worry and look and peep all the fucking time, bitch, move on. Little Fizz and Nikki shared a rendezvous. This bitch came over and cooked breakfast. Stayed over in her best sleeper outfit, her best lingerie, and Lil Fizz thought it would be a good idea to invite Spinach Dip over so she can get out the rest of her shit. You already messing for that already. You don't need to have Nikki over here in her lingerie, all on your counter, on fresh ass counter, bitch, and, and, and to come get this girl to get her stuff. You were being messy, Lil Fizz. You were acting like a bitch. You were acting like a little bitch. But, you know, it's good for TV. I understand. I get it. We see each other. Finish them get there. And she said she was surprised to see Nikki there. And why she dressed like that. And, she, you know, she, she wasn't expecting this, this, that, and third. So she sat on down. And Nikki just ripped right in. She was like, We ain't never had no problem. But, you know, you been running your mouth. Because appetizer was like, I ain't really been running my mouth this, that, and third. And she was like, yes, you have, blah, blah, blah. And this is what shit get real, real. This is what shit hit the fan at, bitch. Nigga was like, well, you get your shit. I packed your little to go bag or whatever. Uh, here you go. Get the bag and she slain that bitch right in Nicky and busted it all in the head. And I was like, good for you, bitch, because that's what you get for being messy. And then Lil Finn's like, oh, you really, really got to go. He going to try to put the bitch about it. She's like, don't touch me. She told all his goddamn face something that's what you get to because you don't treat nobody like that. It's not your place to take out your motherfucking frustrations of the world and your relationship and all that shit on this goddamn girl who ain't did shit to you. And I believe her. You, she, you probably have been playing her goddamn head and leave her home for making things she want to be in a relationship when y'all ass just want to fuck. Be real with the bitch up front. Not after y'all done did what y'all done did you don't offer her the key to your goddamn house she done met your motherfucking mama now you wanna say oh you an appetizer I'm just I'm just sampling bitch I feel her you not gonna play me I'm not no playstation 4 bitch you not gonna play me I'm team spinach dip I really am because you don't treat nobody like that little fizz you don't treat nobody like that you think cause you're light skinned you can do shit like that you probably can you, you probably can but goddamn it the light skin just need to stop today this is some good ass food. I'm, I'm really, I'm really ready to stop the water because the shit's the truth. So, that's all the time I got. Make sure you share this video. If it's your first time liking me and you like what you're seeing, I made you laugh, I made you chuckle. Go ahead and click the subscribe button. It's free, bitch. It's somewhere around here. Left, right, I don't know. Share this video on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, Snapchat. As well as follow me on all those social networks, bitch. I'm active on every last one of them. Peace.